Hey guys, welcome back to part two of painting the rainbow theme. And I know it's been a while since I posted, but uh, since it's the summertime and school's already ending, I might have more time to record videos. And yeah, so hopefully I will spend more time recording videos this summer. Also, I'm thinking of not just making this into a craft channel. I'm thinking of also making it into a gaming channel as well. I like to just do random stuff, so I probably will do gaming on here as well. Let me get back with painting, and now I'm choosing red. To add a layer and another layer to make it look bright. Oh wait, never mind. Now we're <laughs> we're doing orange now, and now we're adding a layer of orange on here to even it out, to smooth it out, to um help with like the what's it called? To get rid of the um to make it look neater and to make it show to pop that color out. Basically, that's what I'm doing right now. Anyways, I'm going to keep on painting, making sure it's the way I want it to be. Now I'm painting on the other side of the purse, and I'm trying to make sure that it's needed. And yes, I'm still using orange, which you can see. I'm not sure why I had to call it out. But anyways, I'm trying to make sure it's needed, and it's evened out, and that uh, you can see the color popping and stuff like that. Anyways, I had so many ideas for this purse. At first, I was thinking of making it square theme, where the colors are different colors, and then I was thinking of making it into a Fruit Loops theme purse, but then I was like, you know what? It just looks nice. I can't add, I'm not gonna, it's gonna look weird if I add too much of it, you know what I mean? Too much color, so I'm just gonna just blend it out a little bit. Now I'm using yellow, and I'm going to paint and add another layer of yellow on there to make sure that the color pops and it's kneaded out, because I don't want it to look, you know, the way I don't want it to look, you know what I mean? I want it to look the way how I see it. And I want it to be presented as, um, as needed for me. <laughs> but anyways, I'm just still painting. And, you know, yellow's a really pretty color, actually. It, re it reminds me of, like, um, happiness. Is it just me? Like, you know that, um, that circle? And it has a cute little face on it. And it has a smiley, yeah, a smiley face. Doesn't it remind you, like, happiness, the color yellow? But anyways, now I'm painting with red. And I'm doing the same thing how I did with orange and yellow, but, um, yeah, I'm, right now I'm just kneading it out, making sure it's the way I want it to be, and making sure it's lined up correctly. But anyways, I'm just still painting. Now I'm going to use the orange paint, and I'm going to try to knead it out, and I'm going to, you know, let that color brighten, because I want it to brighten, like, pop, like... Anyways, that's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> anyways, I'm just still painting. And I'm making sure that everything's neat and that everything is fine. And I'm still painting using the orange. And the reason why I'm taking so much time with this orange, with just painting with the orange, is because like I want the lines to add up and I want them to look neat and actually look like they're adding up together. Like you know what I mean? Now I'm painting with green and I'm gonna copy the lines of the purse so that it can have an even amount of paint and so it can look even. And not like, you know what I mean? And not like, um, messed up because I want it to look even and neat. But basically, yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Anyways, now I'm just painting still and I'm just painting and painting with the green, with the green. And I'm painting with the green, with the green, with the green. Do you like my singing voice? Probably not, but maybe you do, I'm not sure. But anyways, I'm still painting with the green. And I'm actually I'm actually painting at the corners now. And I'm trying to be careful not to get it like get all messed up and try to make it neat and clean. But anyways, I'm still painting. I'm still painting using the green and I'm trying to still follow the lines of the parse. But soon this process will be over and I will move to beautiful is it what comes after green i don't know is it blue or is it purple i'm not quite sure i don't know maybe someone out there knows probably someone out there knows and if you do know please educate me so i don't look stupid but anyways now we're working with the blue the blue 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 blueberry blue 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 actually you know that blueberries don't actually look blue it just looks like it looks like purple to me but um anyways Never mind, off topic, but um, now I'm using the blue, and I'm trying to follow the lines on the purse, and not trying to mess it up, you know what I mean? So I don't get it messy, or I want it to look neat and clean and classy, but um, that's what I'm doing right now. I don't know, is it just me, or does the blue always look like candy to me? It reminds me of candy, some type of candy, but it just looks good. But don't, don't eat paint, don't listen to me, don't eat this paint, okay? You, can, you can't eat paint. Don't, don't listen to me. <laughs> it might look delicious, 
But I tell you, if you eat it, it's toxic and it doesn't taste good. And don't ask me how I know that. But anyways, I'm still painting and now I'm just, you know, following the lines of the purse. And I'm just making sure that it's even and it's neat and it's organized. Not organized. What's the word called? Needed. Yes, that's it. That's what it is. I don't know how many times did I say needed, but, you know, <laughs> hopefully y'all don't get annoyed with it. But anyways, now I'm using the purple and I'm just following the lines of the purse, making sure that it is even and needed. <laughs> and hopefully it will stay, you know neat and clean and not you know miss out of place now i'm painting at the corners of the purse with the purple making sure that it's like lining up right and not gonna look like oh like you know that it just doesn't look like accurate it doesn't look accurate you know what i mean i don't want it to look unaccurate so i want it to look accurate as possible so i'm just following the lines of the purse making sure it's the way that i want it to be but anyways i'm still painting with the purple but the purple with the perp, making sure that all the crevices is covered with the paint, making no mistakes, making sure that it looks great on the daily, every day, making sure on the week, making sure that it looks perfect as <laughs> I'm not a good rapper. Okay, I'm trying. Please, hopefully you enjoyed my rapping skills, even though it doesn't say that I can't rap. <laughs> now I'm using the red, and I am going to follow the lines of the purse, making sure that it's neat. Oh, we're using that word neat, but anyways, making sure that it's even as well. Oops, and I flip in the purse. Flip. But um, anyways, I guess because I couldn't really get a good um painting. What's the word called? What's that word called when you don't know the word? I know the word now. It's called um placement. Where I can't get a good placement of where I want to paint that, and it was just a terrible. Angle. It's your angle. It's angle. It's called angle. Okay, but anyways, I'm still using the red. <laughs> I got distracted for a second, but I'm back. But now I'm using the red. Still. Still using the red. Don't talk about now I'm using the red. I'm still using it. Um, but yeah, I'm just still painting. Just painting with the red. And following the lines as well. Hopefully, I do not. <laughs> Excuse me, mess it up. Mess it up. Hopefully I don't mess it up. Excuse me for my burps. Excuse me for my burps. Sorry I burped, but um, now we're painting. I thought I was about to say blue. But we're painting with green now, so yeah. Green is such a pretty color. It just reminds me of happiness, right? It's like yellow and green. It's just such a happy color. I don't know. Why? I guess St. Patty's Day and then the sun probably related to that. Now we're adding another layer of blue to make sure that the original purse design wasn't show is not showing. And making sure that it's needed and even and that it doesn't look as messy. So that's what I'm mostly just going for, making sure that it's even. They already said that already. They already said even already. I said it so many times in this video <laughs> that it's like annoying. I'm sorry if I keep saying even so many times, neat so many times, but literally. <laughs> but anyways, I'm just, you know, doing my thing, still painting, and I'm just following the lines. See where this is going. The cycle. There's a cycle. There's a cycle going on in this video. It's a cycle going on. But anyway, still painting. Now I'm adding another layer of purple again so it can brighten up the purple and so it can be more evened out. And because so it can look neat, which is the same thing as even, but we're not going to get to there. But um, I think right even and neat is the same, neat is the same thing. I'm not quite sure, who knows. But um... Yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. I'm just adding another layer of purple to make sure that it brightens up the color, and that's it, you know? Now I'm using the red, and I'm going to add another layer of red to make the color pop, like, to make it more brighter. Because I don't want it to be, like, a dull color. Even though the red looks nice right now, I just want it to, like, pop out and stand out more because I like it when I like when colors stand out more to me. So I'm going to just add more layers to it to make it like pop out. That's why I've been adding a lot of layers to Anyways, all the colors I'm painting with the of the rainbow on this purse to make, sure to make it stand out more and then make it look or more make even kind of as well. Because I'm over at the corner of the purse so I'm making sure that I'm not going to mess it up 
the purple or anything because I do not want to do it over again. <laughs> but anyways, I almost finished with the purse. I only got to finish coloring red and then I'm finished. And um, yeah. Thank you for being patient. I know it was like a week of me not posting. Sorry. And this is the finished product of me redesigning the purse. And it looks really nice. It's so colorful. It's so pretty. I love all the colors that's on this purse. It just fits it so well on there. On, on the purse. And it represents rainbow theme completely. And I'm just happy how it turned out. Because I'm just, you know, I'm just happy it just turned out pretty well. And I'm just thankful for y'all for watching this video. And I'm happy that y'all took the time to actually watch my video. And thank you so, so much for being patient. And have an amazing day. And see you in the next video. Bye.